Hello everybody. Today I'm feeling called to share something that I feel is very important for especially, well, in general, but especially for people who feel they are very sensitive to energies. They are, they call themselves maybe empaths or they feel they have rising psychic abilities. Um, and in general, just very sensitive to energies. So what I what I always feel with myself is I found myself very quickly absorbing other people's energy, especially when they tend to be chaotic. And I found that it takes a lot from me to get back into center, to get back into my own energy and to get back into balance. So what I would like to share with you today is how important it is and how much you are allowed to put up boundaries towards situations as well, people who bring imbalance into your own life and especially into your senses. You are allowed to put up boundaries with people who when you, and you can observe that, when you meet them, when you come together and you are together and you part, observe how you feel. If I get involved with people or situations that are very chaotic, I often, afterwards, when I forgot to put up my boundaries, I feel drained. I feel like I have to rest a lot. Or I feel like kind of pushed, like a lot of drive. Either way, it's, it's, a challenge to get back into my center. So I wanted to share that with you that you are allowed to put up those boundaries. And we can do that in many ways. We can communicate clearly by just saying I need more space. If that is not possible or you don't feel comfortable with that, you are allowed to just withdraw. You can do your thing, you can be in your own place, you don't have to respond. You are, are allowed to do that. It's very important because boundaries, putting up boundaries often is difficult for the ones who feel guilty about putting them up. So we feel guilty or you feel guilty putting up boundaries and not getting involved as much with those people or those situations. And therefore we actually fall into being involved in that. So don't feel any guilt to put up your boundaries. Do it in a way that you feel comfortable with. And what happens when we manage that, to put up our boundaries, you get Number one, you get really empowered in regards to yourself. You feel like you are honoring your space. And that is what gives you the power about yourself. Other people cannot take your energy away or put dump their energy onto you. You manage to say, this is my space and you're not allowed to come in. It empowers you a lot. And when you feel empowered and you feel you can't take care of yourself, you have automatically more energy to truly focus on what you want, what you desire. If we are constantly distracted by those kind of energies that are bringing imbalance into our life, it's like you don't know where you are. It's like, what's happening here? So, doof, 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 doof. <laughs> and if we pull back and we empower ourselves, 
space is created so that we can say, okay, this is what I want. This is what I need. This is where I'm heading. That is my dream. It creates possibilities for you to follow what you want and are not being pulled out of your own energetic field. Yes, and I think this is very important when it comes to creating the kind of life that you truly desire. It helps tremendously to put up those boundaries, stay in your own energy without guilt and figuring out that's what I want, that's where I'm going. Take good care.